Okay, now to the cool part. We've got Land School open and our class list set up. If you double click on a student's screen, you'll be able to see the same thing that's on their screen and see what they're doing. To exit this view once you have it open, drop down the options next to the control button and select stop viewing. You can also use these options to take over their computer and show them how to do something. You can also show your screen to the whole class with the show button. Make sure you've loaded your class list so you're not sharing your screen to the whole student body at once. When you press the show button, you'll see two options in that drop down, windowed or full screen. Windowed will allow students to switch between your display and any other app they may have open on their own computer. If you're walking them through a process on their computers, and they could use this to switch back and forth, which might be helpful. But if you'd like to force their computers into a simple projection of your screen and nothing else, use full screen. Similarly, you can also turn off their screens or have it display a message with the blank screens button. There are some ways to limit certain apps and websites, but I'll skip over that as it probably won't be too relevant. You can also build tests and polls you share with your students, but I'm eager to show you some better assessment tools later on in a different course. You can feel free to explore these options and or set up uh, some training with me. The last thing I want to show you though is the show student button. This is great if you'd like to share a student's screen with the rest of the class, which would be perfect if you want to give a student some props for doing great work or if you'd like to get the class to help with a certain student and get them unstuck on a problem. Well enjoy and let me know if you have any questions.